Hello, and good morning, and welcome back to the Moonflare HQ. You are maybe wondering why I look like this, and it's because I am about to put makeup on. That is because I'm going to film a video today, actually a new class for my nail academy. And it is a crystal application class, so it will also be available uh, for promo sometimes like if you buy a crystal kit, then you will get this crystal class for free So on so on. I am also going to fix my hair I'm a bit confused right now because I have a headache and it is almost Transforming over to become migraine. <clears throat> so I just had some some paracetamol and hopefully that will kick in very soon but right now I'm a little bit confused and very tired so I figured let's do the makeup do the hair and hopefully by the time I'm done I have a little bit more energy <clears throat> let's start out by saying good morning to Tesso hey Tesso hey hey <laughs> there she is <laughs> One third done. I can hear screaming coming out from <laughs> Tessa. <laughs> What's happening? I'm trying to find your scream. My scream. <laughs> She's editing the vlog and she is trying to find a perfect uh, scream sound. I'm very curious about this vlog. <laughs> <laughs> One thing that um, my hairdressers always tells me is that I, I have a lot of hair, but I've noticed that since COVID and all that, I've lost so much hair. Ugh. And I have become super gray. I don't know if you can see, but I have like, so much gray in my hair since being sick with COVID and I've heard that that's kind of like a thing you get you lose your hair and then you get gray hair <laughs> thanks so let's just uh, do the rest mm -hmm. So my regular makeup looks a little bit different from when I'm filming. When I'm filming, I obviously have to put on a lot more than I would usually do. And that's just because the camera kind of eats it up a little bit. So normally, 
I would not do this all over my face. I would just do it like on my cheeks. But since we're going to film, I'm gonna do it all over. I'm not really a fan of having makeup all over my face, but yep. It is what it is. One thing that's a bit tricky when you um, can't really see what you are doing is that you don't really know what you are doing. So every time I do my makeup, I'm more or less winging it. Um, but I think I have managed to wing it pretty good so far. In, uh, I think the previous vlog, in the comments, I got a comment saying that my eyebrows are too thick. So, today, I am going to make them extra thick, just for you. I actually have uh, a new appointment scheduled to uh, microblade my brows again. I did them a couple years ago, but obviously it has faded. And I did have an appointment scheduled right before I uh, got sick with COVID and all, like two years ago. So obviously we had to cancel it and it has taken me this long to be able to do stuff like that again without having my body to react like I just broke a bone. Uh, so now I have a new appointment scheduled on... February 7th So I am super happy and excited about that. It is the same person who did my eyelids in me. So she's gonna do my brows again and that's gonna be so nice By the way, I'm using my favorite palette from Linda Halberg. Uh, she's a friend of mine. She's fantastic Swedish makeup artist and she makes amazing makeup. So go and check it out. She also loves using the Moogler crystals for her makeup designs and they're so pretty. this here maybe no it's gonna be too hard I'll come back back so I'm doing the superhero eyeliner and that is because you know if I look straightforward it looks normal but when I close my eyes they look like that and that's just because I got hooded eyes but uh, that is what we are trying to fix a little bit with the procedure on my eyelids it has worked wonders, but obviously I can't get rid of it all because it's like the shape of where my eye sockets sit and my eyes are whatever. But I think it looks pretty cool. I like the superhero eyeliner look anyway, so. Hmm. Sometimes are harder than others. This day is a little bit tougher because of the headache, but I will push through, we'll set up the station, uh, write my script and just get it done with um, but yeah that's life sometimes you have to push through whatever is going on and that is what I'm doing right now mm. all done Okay. Ooh. Love oh, the light. Gorgeous. The light Woo! of elegance. A light elegance. <laughs> okay. Ah. Mm. I can stand here all day and pretend that I'm not tired. 
Is it approved by the makeup artist? Of course. This is probably the worst thing about filming in general, setting up. It would probably take me like 10 minutes, but still it feels like 500 hours. So I'm gonna do that now. Yes. This is the camera I use uh, for when I'm filming uh, myself, uh, like sitting down filming, and it is a Sony A6500. This is great for filming, so I don't really use it for stills, but it is Sony in general, it's fantastic for um, moving footage. Same thing with my vlog camera, it's also a Sony, it's actually a Sony A5100 and then I use a Nikon for my um, stills, but I actually use that for my tutorials as well but that's just because I love the uh, lens that goes with it because it's a zoom and it's a macro but yeah, anyways, I'm gonna use this now So this is uh, the full setup right here. Usually I don't have the flowers there, but I figured why not change it up or maybe maybe it should be just clean. Uh, should be clean. I'm going to remove the flower. Sorry. You will have to be there for the next video. Ah. I'm going to go grab lunch. And then I'm gonna come up here. We're gonna have lunch. We're gonna watch Final Space. Yay! Whoa! <laughs> and then I am going to write my script. And then we're gonna film. So I just got back from the store and I have bought myself pretty much uh, baby food. Uh, it's. Um, Stuva de macaroner falkorv. I don't even know if that's a thing outside of Sweden. Tesso, oh do you have stuva de macaroner or falkorv outside of Sweden? I don't know. It's like a mac and cheese without the cheese. <laughs> but it's not cheese even. It's just like cream. Yeah. Okay, so the the stuva. Yeah, stuva. Yeah, ingen aning. No. It's very Swedish, cute smell. So the pasta, the macarons. Do you say macarons? No, that's uh, macaron. macarons. Macarons. <laughs> but the macaroner. Macaroni. Macaroni? Okay, they're like in some gooey stuff that's cream. And then I have falu korv, which uh, basically is uh, falu sausage. Um, and um... <laughs> stop it! <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it's a, it's a, a thick ass sausage that you slice in slices. Yeah. Okay, explain it better, please. No, I don't know. <laughs> Falu. Give it a go. Give it a go. Falu. So that's just that's it's a, a place. place. That's a place in Sweden, like fall, but but like Falu. A sausage from Falu. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sausage from Falu, but Falu. Do Falu. There must be Falu. Yeah. So it's a sausage from Dalarna. I don't know. But if you have been looking at very old Swedish pornos, <laughs> then you know what it is. Oops. <laughs> Especially from the 70s. And if you had, we don't want to know. Yes, <laughs> exactly. Don't tell us. 
There's actually a song about this type of sausage and it's called flowery falu sausage. <laughs> Jag vill ha blom i falu kom till lunch Mamma, mot annars vill jag inte ha Copyright här Nej, just det! Jag hatar tomaten Och fisken och spenaten Och Splättarna med lingonsylt Nu är du kanske superkurious Vad det ser ut som Och det är I mean, don't get your hopes up. <laughs> it just looks like this. So yeah, I'm gonna eat that now with some ketchup. Woo! Are you uh, using your nails? Me? Ah. Okay, this is how you do it. Yes. Are you using your nails? Me? Ah. Okay, this is how you do it. Bread. <laughs> Yay. Not sponsored, but wants to be sponsored. Wants to be sponsored. <laughs> Mango! Yeah! Mm. Just look at your new ambassador, Noko. She <laughs> looks fantastic. She got so many Noko skills. Yes. Mm. Okay, food. Food. Final space. Let's do it. <laughs> Ta-ta! Final space. If you have seen Final Space... Um... Put mooncake in the comments. Then we know that you love, love, blah, that you like fun space. Mooncake. gonna get coffee uh, okay so that all that it kind of helped with the energy but at the same time my headache got worse but it was it was kind of worth it <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to I don't know find some more energy here so I'm gonna I'm gonna have some coffee Tesla's gonna have cafe Tesla's gonna have cafe I uh, actually just came back because I was picking up a package uh, at my parents' house uh, when we sent, uh, well, well, when we order stuff for the shop, usually we send them over to my parents' house because they're always home. So uh, I just picked it up and it's a brand new product. This time I can actually show you a brand new product. This time it's not something that I have already shown you. It's actually a new product. Coffee, ma'am? So I'm taking uh, things very easy today because of my headache and everything. So uh, now I'm gonna drink some coffee and then I'm gonna start writing my script and then uh, I'm gonna sit over here and start filming myself. And me apparently. <laughs> When I'm done filming myself, I'm gonna film from above, like my hands showing the demo. 
and uh, that's about it. Time is now 2.15, so I have a couple of hours to do this, but sometimes, you know, when I have days like these, when I have like migraine, I just had a migraine, medi my migraine medicine, so it's gonna kick in maybe in an hour, um, but my brain works on like 10% right now, so that's gonna be a little bit difficult because when I'm filming, I have a hard time remembering what I am supposed to say, so I'll just have to take it maybe like sentence by sentence. And also during the entire day, I have to do things step by step. So it's like, okay, now I do this and now I do coffee and now I do that. So now it's coffee and writing script and I have to focus on that. And then I move on to the next step. What are you doing? I'm writing coffee for a reel. Mm -hmm. That's going up on Saturday. Which reel? It's dump his ass. A dump his ass. <laughs> dump his ass. He refuses to go to therapy. Dump his ass. He does something mean and then tells you to stop being overdramatic. Dump his ass. And then I'm gonna do some content for my nail academy. Uh -huh. Your nail mm -hmm. academy. <laughs> <laughs> the latter class of us are my nail academy. My new <laughs> nail academy. <laughs> So it's your yeah. my nail academy. You are my nail academy. Now come and Dagens explosion presenteras av. So I've been working on the script and it is so much more than I thought to begin with. So I don't know if I have the time to actually uh, film this today, which feels a shame because I did all this makeup and my hair, but hopefully, I mean, I did kind of the foundations or foundation for the hair for tomorrow and I set everything up so I might as well just continue tomorrow I'll see but I'm going to take a break now and let's open a package because we have not opened the package yet here it is let's grab a knife knifey knife eh. <sighs> So let's take a look. We got, as mentioned, we got rose gold, uh, black, gold, and silver. And we have them in six different sizes. And of course, uh, these go so well together with our crystals. Uh, also, these packages go kind of like in the same theme. Uh, that I wanted for the crystals because since you have like six different um, sizes we got six different sizes in here and that is what I always recommend if you want to make something look more advanced or intricate or like interesting in general add different sizes it doesn't matter if you are doing nail art and maybe adding dots to your design make them in different sizes that will make it look so much more advanced if you have uh lines if you're just drawing lines straight lines make some a little bit more thick some a little thinner and so on so if you change the sizes of things even if it's the same color uh it just makes it so much more detailed and it makes it look so much more advanced so that's why i wanted these in different sizes and uh, then you have all the different colors here that you will need to match our crystals and whatever you are doing. Okay, so I'll continue with uh, my little script here. We'll see how far I get. If I am too tired to film today, then I will do it tomorrow and then we'll continue the vlog tomorrow. Yes, that's right. Uh, I feel like that's probably gonna happen. We'll see um, because 
my migraine is so much better right now, but now I'm like after migraine-ish, so now I am super tired instead. Sleepy, sleepy. It's very sleepy. Yes. Uh, and I want to be alert and high on energy when I film, obviously. Uh, so that is something that is very important. So I'd rather just take the energy that I have left to write my script and then maybe just continue tomorrow. We'll see what happens. I think it sounds like a good plan. I think it sounds like a good plan. Okay. Okay, so we have decided to wrap things up for the day. Um, so my pretty face was totally unnecessary. Mm, or maybe not. You got to enjoy it. At least. Um, but everything is set up and ready. Uh, I'm almost done with the script. I will continue tomorrow. Uh, we checked the new products and uh, we have done a lot of work anyways. Yes. But we're ready to go home now. So um, to be continued in like two seconds. 24 hours later. <laughs> 24 hours later. Okay, see you in uh, just a bit. Just so stick around. We'll be back tomorrow, but now. Okay, bye. The next day. Good morning. It is the day after. And I'm back at the studio. Tess was on our way. It is 9.45 in the morning. And I'm about to put my makeup back on and do my hair all over again well luckily no we still have the setup ready and uh, so yeah and here i have whoops here i have my makeup and all so i'm just gonna do that have some tea and uh, continue with the script hopefully finish that and uh start filming finally <laughs> So, yeah, let's just uh, continue with the vlog. Day two. All done. Again. Hair. Makeup. And guess who's here? Well, Today as well. Yes. <laughs> Hello. Oh. Hello. And you got your water. Yes. Yes. Almost drank half of it. Yes. Oh, jävlar. Ja. Vad ska du är duktig då? I tried. Uh-huh. What's uh, happening today for you? Uh, today is a takeover. Just uh, she'll see. She's starting uh, any minute now. Mm. She has a later day because mm. she's a gym manager. Just so from 11 to 8. Mm. She's going to do the takeover. Mm. And then I'm uh, looking at some pictures the girl has sent me. Mm -hmm. Really nice, really nice. Mm. We'll be up soon. <laughs> 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 Sounds lovely. So I'm gonna get back to uh, the script. So I'm gonna do that and finish wrapping that up and then move on to my filming station. Hmm. I'm still working on the script, but I think I'm getting another migraine attack. So we're taking a little break now. I will have lunch. It's in there. We will watch Final Space. And then hopefully I can dodge this. Maybe I can take some medication or medicine. Uh, I'll see. But yeah, right now I just feel like I need to go to sleep. But I will not. I don't want to do this again. <laughs> I will succeed. And Tesso is getting elect electrical shots from everything. What is it? Shots? Electrical? Shot, 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 electrical shocks from everything. I had to remove my, yeah, my beautiful unicorn slippers. Uh, slippers. They are betraying you. I think yeah. so. <laughs> or the foot stand. Yes. What do we call it? Yes. We will try without that. See what happens. Because it's not my share. It's not the chair. <laughs> it's not the chair. It's, it's not, not the chair. chair. It is not the chair. <laughs> Hopefully a little bit of pasta and a little bit of final space and maybe some coffee will turn this around. Uh, because now I've started to see 
Grumbit. Tessel had to translate that. So hot, so hot, so hot. Getting coffee and continuing with our nose space. Try number two. Yes! <laughs> My um, external monitor is broken, that is why I'm uh, jumping back and forth. Very nice. I'm almost ready to go. This is what it looks like now. There's Tesso. Hi. And uh, I don't use the ring light as a ring, I actually only use it as a stand. I only use these two... Um, lights right here and then I have this light in the back just kind of make the background look a little bit prettier and now I need to uh, uh, empty this memory card because I only had like six minutes left on this so need to do that and then I will start with my four page long manuscript that I thought was going to be like half a page but no why make it easy for you when you can make it super hard <laughs> so application course in this course I will teach you the fundamentals on how to apply crystals to your crystal but then you put a coating on top of it which will give you that AB effect so let's go back to the cake so if we are cutting the cake in half the inside will be like clear let's say a white Testing, testing, hello, hello. Blah, blah, blah. Hey, hello, hey, allihopa. Blah, blah, blah. Hey, hey. <laughs> la, la. Far, jag kan inte få upp min kokosnöt till lite i alla sätt jag pröva att ha vart fyll. Boom, boom. Med en i. Så hygge så jag blir stel. Oh my god! I'm done. I'm done. I finished wrapping up. Like that's a wrap. Yay! Can I get a little bit of support here? Yay! <laughs> Not forced at all. Ah, I'm so happy that I managed to do this because my brain is like porridge right now. Uh, but I did it and it's three o'clock so I can actually start editing this a little bit which is nice and I will probably leave this set up because once I start editing sometimes I notice that I forgot something so then I tend to leave it up like this um, and then I can just go back and add whatever I need to add so that's good but I'm so happy that I'm done so let's start editing Yay, fizz. Um, so right now I am editing and it looks good, except that my brain farted majorly <laughs> and I forgot to set up the mic for my camera. Yeah, that's how brain farted my brain is when I have a migraine. Uh, so it works still though, because it is a pretty darn good camera. The sound isn't awesome, but luckily I happen to have a boyfriend who is like a sound music pro. So he sound is... wizard. Yes. <laughs> so he will uh, definitely help me uh, fix that. So it's gonna, it's gonna sound okay. It looks very good though. I'm happy about that. I managed to adjust the, the lighting this time. I did a crappy job with the lighting in the previous video that I did. So this time I'm super happy about the lighting. Uh, 
And we also remembered that we need to tell you something. We're moving. <laughs> not from here though. No, no, we are not moving. We are not moving, but the Moon Flare warehouse is moving because we are growing so much and we have lots of stuff coming in very soon. So we need a bigger place. A bigger place for our little Moon Flare family yes. to grow into. Yes. So we are moving the entire warehouse to a different city even. Yes. So up until then, uh, the move is going to be ready uh, like end of April, actually. Yeah, so it's going to take a little while. Until then, we will only be able to sell within Sweden. So we will not be able to sell internationally from moveflare.shop. However, we still have our trusty international distributors. Uh, we have Creata for Canada and the States. I know they even ship to like well, Mexico. I know they ship to like Australia even. Uh, they pretty much ship everywhere. And then we have Monai for Benelux. So you have Belgium, the Netherlands. Oh, sorry, what else? Luxembourg. Luxembourg. And then they also sell pretty much to the entire Europe. So uh, if you happen to be in Europe, you can probably get it from her, monai.be. Uh, and also, we are working on a distribution ship for uh, Norway and also, of course, UK. Yes. Uh, so hopefully that will be uh, all fixed and settled and whatever very soon. But from moveflare.shop, uh, we can only sell within Sweden for the, you know, the upcoming three months. And after that, we will open up to the entire world. So you have to bear with us, but stick around. So it's gonna be worth it. Yes, it's really going to be. Yes. And you're gonna see us uh, do the actual move. The move, yes. Oh, the move. The move. You are going to move with us. Yes. That's gonna be fun. Yes. Yay, can't wait. Whee. Ah. I just finished. <laughs> <laughs> the base cutting or whatever you want to call it for this course and now uh, the thing that's left is that oh, obviously I need to do nails and apply crystals and show you because now I only film myself and now I need to film my hands um, I'm not gonna do that today but time is uh, 4 35 ish 4 40 so I will start rigging and setting up for tomorrow so then when I get here tomorrow I can just sit down and start painting and I will also prepare like a list of things that I need to film so I have everything done and it's gonna go really fast hopefully so and it's also nice to get this light stand thingy out of the way so I'm gonna do that now <laughs> for today how would you sum it up uh, productive productive I think we got a lot done mm. you will see the we're moving announcement up mm. live yes uh, for a week ago no. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah I finished the vlog editing mm. tomorrow we're gonna do the thumbnail mm. that's gonna be fun yes and I did some content for my nail academy yeah your nail academy <laughs> my, na my your academy. my nail academy yes hmm? so I think it was productive yes I'm just so happy that I managed to film anything today. So, yay! Yay! yay. <laughs> I beat the pork. I was saying pork. The pork. <laughs> pork porridge. Pork bread. The pork bread. <laughs> the pork bread. Perfect. The porridge bread. Oh, so, yep, we're going home. Uh, coming in tomorrow, I will uh, finish 
uh, the video, the course, and uh, film my nails. And this video that I have been filming now is a crystal application course. So you will actually get it for free if you buy a Moonflare kit from moonflare.shop. Uh, you will probably get it for free also if you buy a kit from Munai, Belgium, and Creata, Canada, New uh, States. So uh, that's gonna be awesome. And it's also gonna be available at mynailacademy.com. Um, for purchase if you uh, don't want the kit, but I mean, who doesn't want the kit? <laughs> Thanks for watching, uh, don't forget to subscribe if you have not already, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, and don't forget to comment, because we love comments, and since we have not posted our last video, we don't have uh, the official like comment in the comment section that we're gonna answer. No. No, so we're gonna start with that for the next video, but... Um, Ask questions and we will uh, pick one to answer for the next video. Yay. Okay. Bye bye.